hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and in today's video i am going to do some color touch up on my hair because as you can see it's a little bit fading and i like my hair like jet black especially when it's short it kind of gives me like volume after that i will do like a mold i'm not gonna curl my hair i'm just gonna do like a mold and a little bit of styling on top so here is the color that i'm using is by Calville, and this one is in ebony black it's a semi-permanent color so that's why i'm touching up because it only lasts about five to six washes but it still look pretty good i just want my hair to be dyed again i'm just gonna put on some gloves first and if you want you can go ahead and put like some vaseline or some sort of petroleum jelly around you ears and stuff especially if you're using like a permanent color maybe like do some uh greasing around the perimeter of your head and also like your ears and stuff but with this one i find that like it just fades while i'm washing it's kind of like a rinse in a way but it lasts a little bit longer than a normal rinse so first i'm just gonna shake it it, it comes pre-mixed in this bottle and it also has like an applicator so i'm just gonna go ahead and start applying the dye all over my hair and i don't really go like step by step i just like apply as i go make sure like everything is saturated with the color and i also like to focus mostly on like my um the areas that are th my hair is thin um like my edges here So I'm done applying the dye, so I'm just going to put on a shower cap and I'm going to leave this on for about 30 minutes and then I will rinse and then we can come back. So I am back after washing my hair and I'm going to go ahead and start molding my hair. I'm using the Design Essential Composition Wrap Set Lotion and some of you have been asking me where I get this from. I get it from Take A Lot. Um, I don't know where else you can get it. Maybe you can just look online. But I once bought it from Hair City in Bedford. Yeah, Hair City in Bedford Center. But that was years ago. And I don't know if they still have it. But I find that it's easy to just get it from Take A Lot. It's quick delivery. And yeah, so this is what I'm going to use. This is my favorite mousse. I use it all the time. And I find that it actually it does last longer than the ORS. But if you can get this one, you can always try the ORS one. It does work, but in my opinion, this one is the best. So I'm just applying it all over my head. Make sure everything is saturated. And I'm going to take my retail comb and start uh, molding my head down.
and for my mold today i just want it to be like super perfect because i don't really plan on curling my hair and i still want it to last long so i'm just molding it down and then i will do a little bit of waves up here in the front but for now i'm just focusing on getting everything laid perfectly so i'm just adding a little bit more at the back here So now I'm gonna just take some wrap strips and I'm gonna go ahead and wrap my hair. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and dry my hair and then I'll come back once my hair is dry. So I am back now with my hair dry and this is how it's looking. And this is the back. So everything is dry. And now I'm gonna take some of this Jamaican black castor oil hair food. And I'm going to apply a small amount all over my hair just to add a little bit of moisture and some shine. And so you can go ahead and leave it as it is like this as a hairstyle it does look cute it looks nice and sleek but i'm gonna go ahead and comb out my mold um just starting from the top here So now for style, like I said, I'm not going to curl my hair today. I'm just combing it up, mostly like the longish hair. And then the rest of it, I'm just going to leave it as it is. So basically just creating a little bit of volume up here. And just finger comb it a little bit to give it like a, to like zhuzh it. And I'm also using my um, white tooth comb to just help style this hair. So yeah this is the final look and i'm just gonna turn and show you guys how it's looking at the back and here is the other side 
so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and don't forget to thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i will see you guys in the next one bye